Hi everyone, I'm Flinty and I'm playing South Park The Fractured Butthole or The Fractured Butthole because that's a funny title um, so yeah the second proper South Park game after the Stick of Truth I guess there were fewer I guess there were other South Park games uh, back in the 90s maybe back in 2001 or 2 or whatever but this RPG and the last one are the uh, the only decent games that have the franchise names on it uh, this one is not made by Obsidian. Uh, I think it, this is a different studio that made this game under the reign of Ubisoft. And uh, But still, Matt Stone and Trey Parker were very much involved with this game. With the story, with the characters and the jokes, stuff like that. So uh, I, I'm suspecting like this game will be just as good as uh, Stick of Truth. Now that wasn't a very special game, but it was at least fun. And I love South Park. It's... Uh, I think I've seen every episode uh, for about how many seasons are there now? 2021. I think the 21st one is running right now. And I really love the humor. Um, it's not as good as it used to be, I, I have to admit that. But still, it's still quite funny. So that's why I'm playing uh, this game. So let's, uh, let's start it. If it works, at least. Ah, there we go. All right, new game. Playing with my controller on PC. Have you tried out every toilet yet? No, I haven't. What has become of this city? There used to be laws, justice, not anymore. Crime is out of control, cats are missing, and townspeople are being victimized. Oh, hey, who pooped on my porch? What's going on with you? Whoa, whoa! We were supposed to protect those who couldn't protect themselves. Get, get off my car, you little pecker! Now superheroes are torn apart by political differences. We are two sides at war. But war isn't going to save our city. Time travel is my only hope now. Myths tell of ancient times. When a new king united a kingdom torn apart by a powerful stick. Hi, hon. Shut up, ma'am. There's no time to waste. I have to go back, change the present if I can, and find this cat. And in doing so, Perhaps I can change what has happened to all of us. Okay, and now we get into character creation. So I think like in the uh, previous game, we are a hero that is not uh, yet uh, a character in South Park. Uh, the intro is very well done. The Coon, of course, Eric Cartman. Now, I remember the uh, Stick of Truth were, uh, was about the Coon and Friends, but the Coon and Friends were actually introduced in just a regular episode, I think. I guess it was a, a trilogy or something like that. But, um, yeah, let's, let's make our character here. Let's, uh, let's get on with the hair. Let's not make him bold. I'm going for a uh, male character. So, apparently, we can just decide the gender with the hair. Or does it really... Maybe it doesn't really matter. I guess we don't have to pick a gender. Alright. Um, what else do we have? Let's go on right. We can change the color if we so wish to. I might like this, uh, this hair. Half long. Curly. What else do we have? No, 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 it's a little bit generic. This one could be fun, but that's like Kyle, right? 
without the head. Mm. Maybe this one? Yeah, nah, not really. And that's it. All right, I think I made up my mind. I'm going to go. This one could be nice, though. Okay, this one or... Okay, let's put you on the front again. Or where was it? Uh, this one. I guess I go with this one. Let's see what we can do. But whoa, that's a lot of colors. Let's uh, try to keep it quite normal. Um, I made that mistake with Mass Effect and Romana. Totally weird character came out of that. Alright, I guess I kind of like the base color, the, the green, not the green, the the the, the brown. Um, what was it though? It was this. It's just a little bit like this. All right, let's. I'm fine with that. Select. Okay. Yeah. Sure. Back. Makeup. Do we want makeup? No, I don't think we do. Facial hair. It's a little bit weird for a child, but it could be fun, right? This is like Gerald Broflovsky a little bit. I, I don't know, it's kind of weird. A child having facial hair, let's, let's avoid it. Eyewear. No, no glasses. Clothes. Oh man, we can change the color of the clothes as well. And what are the... Okay, this is the cape we can adjust. I don't know, let's... Uh, oh, maybe we could make it yellow, maybe we could make it green. I guess let's let's go for yellow. I'm not sure why. But let's not make it too crazy if we can. Okay, now the, the shirt has to be a little bit of a matching color. Right? White, maybe? Yeah. Oh, so now the cape is red actually. I thought we made it yellow. Oh, I guess we need to select it right like that. All right. This could work. A little bit of green, bluish, light blue. Eh, maybe, maybe. Dark blue. Yeah, what the hell? Why not? We maybe we can change it later on if we so wish to. Okay, let's head back. What else do we have? The hands. Really, we can adjust the hands. The color of the, uh, I guess, the gloves he wears. Wow, well, we could make it green. Maybe, maybe black will do. Was that the the color already when we started out? No, black doesn't do actually. What about red? What does red do? I guess, I guess red is fine for now. There we go. And next. Choose difficulty. Okay, what do we have? I guess this is normal. If this is easy, normal, very difficult. Don't worry, this doesn't affect combat. Just every other aspect of your whole life. Okay, now let's just put it in between. But this should be normal. This was default, so I'm not sure. Like this could be hard, very hard, very... No, okay, this is normal, I think. So select and continue. I remember the stick of truth it wasn't that hard or normal, so... Let's do it. And create. So for the people who, does, who don't know the Stick of Truth yet, this is a role-playing game. Um, not as hardcore as uh, maybe you are used to of a role-playing game, but still. It is turn-based combat and stuff like that. Um, and I'm hoping to see very, very familiar characters uh, from the, the, uh, the television show. Definitely. Create.
<laughs> okay, I'm the king. It's my toilet. Your toilet? Oh, that's the quest. Hold on, rotate to find the sweet spot. All right, that's off to a good start, I guess. Focus your power. All right, let's try to actually hold. Yeah. Okay, this is the sweet spot. News anchor shuffle. Okay. Okay. Rotating. Punch it off. And I'm the juice master. Good. Nice. Are those my parents? Okay, we can jump. That's what the game actually said before. Let's... Uh, okay, we can fart. He really still has to fart after taking a shit. Alright, we can uh, swipe. Or at least attack. What else? Oh, this small fart? Okay, we can let out a big fart and a, and a small fart. Alright, what else? The menu, game past, save. We can save our game. Can we save our game everywhere? I think we can. Combat difficulty options. I don't think we have to go through that again. Anything else? Help you, soft club? No, thank you. All right. What is this? The inventory, settings and gallery, photo gallery, wallpaper. Why do I want to? Can we select the wallpaper for the menu? Maybe landscapes. All right. Let's uh, let's do this one actually. Sure. Textures. This is like the iPhone. All right. Fine. Customize. No, not really. I don't care. I guess this is my phone. Yeah, it is. So, inventory, what do we have? We have some components. Food. It takes the right blend of skill, creativity, and flagrant disregard for food safety codes to turn any food into combat super snacks. Collect food to craft healing items, antidotes, and revives. We don't have any cash. We have a mission item. It's a towel. It's a good thing your gaming bot, Towelie, gave you this. In a world of depravity and filth, there's no telling when you might need an Egyptian cotton 600 thread cowed hand towel. I'm not sure what we use that. Consumables we don't have. And that's basically it. Not difficult. Okay, let's see if we can interact. We have treasure. Anal itch away. Okay, bottle of a... What? Let's check that out. What do we have? Meds. From laxatives to designer drugs like distilled cash. The wares of Big Pharma are yours to plunder and bend to heroic designs. Collect meds to craft healing... Okay, I think we've already read that, right? They're just seen as meds now. The other, the other name is, is gone. Alright. Anything else we want to plunder? Okay, let's uh, see what's going on. We should be happy that he's made friends in this town so quickly. We came here to hide. More friends just means more trouble. You're being paranoid. You need to lay off that stuff. It's changing you. Oh, lay off. It's the one thing that helps me relax from your stupid shit. Oh, hey, whippersnapper. Didn't see you there. Your friends are downstairs, kiddo. Get out there and play. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> They seem to be like very nice parents. All right. What the hell is he doing? Hey, look! Oh. You brought a towel. Hey, man! I'm Towel, your gaming bud. I'm gonna give you some tips from time to time because, well, who doesn't like tips, right? All right then. I'll see you later. Oh yeah, good old Towelie. I've missed him for a long while in the episodes. Uh, so I guess he's to be my sidekick, Towelie, the one who smokes stuff. A battery, tack and scrap, box cutter. So when we collect this, uh, it doesn't really matter what kind of uh, stuff that is. It's just uh, put in one category, mainly tack. While sleeping through science class, a freak IntelliLink accident gave you the ability to transform everyday electronics and chemical compounds into astounding crime-finding devices. And scrap to the cunning junksmith, South Park is a gold mine of plastics, downcycled metal, and landfill bric-a-brac ready to be reborn into powerful tools against evil. All right, that's that's the only thing. I think we can craft stuff. Let's speak. <laughs> oh, 
<laughs> all right yeah that's that's fine just uh, sneakily eating something looks just like a chocolate cookie or something let's let's see what happens if we peek again Now it's locked, so okay, so we can't peek again. So we can't exhaust that option. I don't want to try to miss a detail. Let's have a look around. This will be my room, I guess. Yeah. I'm calling it my, but he doesn't have a name. So I guess it's just me. Duct tape, bolt of cloth, LARP, LARP phone. What the hell? Is that something new we got? We did. Bolt of cloth. Redefine your hero brand with no, nothing but scraps of fabric and a lust for needlework. They are required to for costumes and duct tape binds almost anything in the universe together, including a mosquito's mouth, when you won't stop talking about bloodborne diseases. That's that's Kyle, right? Mosquito. I think. Or is it Stan? Not sure. What else do we have? We have a fish. Oh, that's the um, something something globe 2000 whatever. I'm not sure. Game, game sphere. That's totally something different. Let's see what we got. It's updating. <laughs> I guess that's to mock uh, current game consoles because it's just always updating. Let's let it update. Maybe it'll finish, or maybe it just will stay there on 24 percent. Deck of playing cards, we can uh, turn on a computer. Let's open the toy box first. Super streamer outfit costume. Oh, okay, yeah, that's the hat. That's part of the costume. Gloves, headwear, sure, take all. Alien Pro, Breath of Elf Ears, King Robes, Kenny Crown. I'm not sure if that's the DLC. Could be. Ooh, and I've gained some money. Let's check it out what we got. Um, inventory, inventory, we did get some biohazard stuff. First rule of crafting, waste nothing, not even waste itself. Where an ordinary sees a pile of crap, you see the building blocks of justice. Same goes for piss, jizz, and deadly pathogens. Alright. Edgar's glue, keep away from malnourished preschoolers. It's for crafting, use writing. Consumables? Where are my outfits? Where do we equip my outfits? I'm actually not quite sure. We can do that a wardrobe or something. Okay, let's check it one more time and maybe it still needs to be unlocked or something. Consumables, component mission items. No, that's definitely not it. Settings, gallery. No, definitely not. And it's not here. So I'm not sure. We'll find out later, I assume. Okay, we can't actually uh, see what's going on on the computer, so let's just leave it on. Everything leave it on for now. It's bad for nature, but you know. It's just a game. All right, let's head downstairs. Very familiar looking house. I guess the, the wife is crying, the mother. We got a pamphlet. That's considered scrap. Yeah, okay. Okay, there's my mother. <laughs> Mommy, stop crying, sweetheart. I just have something stuck in my eye. <laughs> I'm sure you do. <laughs> Uh, all right any more stuff okay let's talk to her your friends are at the front door honey go outside and play okay um let's see what we got just now we got some food we got some macaroni the staple of convenient vigilante dinners is now an object object of the divine we can craft macaroni pictures okay used for powerful and ancient rituals tortilla the mighty tortilla isn't just a versatile culinary wrap 
It's a vital food stuff to unlock the true potential of your ass. Nice. Sports bottle, raise your hydration game to heroic new levels. Okay. Again, these are just craftables. No, no currently usable <laughs> items just yet. All right, so my friends are at the door, so let's see if we can go down here. No, we can't go to the basement. Nothing on the TV. That's a lithium battery. Okay, let's open them up. Let's see who it is. My lord, the filthy Moorish are attempting to overtake Koopa Keep. You gotta come fight, my liege. You're our only hope. Okay. My lord, come on, dude. Butters and Kyle, fine. It's a mess out here. Sharks. Where are you going, my lord? That is world's end. Okay. Wait a second, we need to open these ones. I remember from the Stick of Truth, but we can't open it yet. Okay, let's follow Clyde and... Kyle, not Clyde, and Butters, all right. What, you just moved to town and you get to be king? Well, I think you're a little pussy. Punch that more in the face, king. Sure. Yeah, he can't talk to you like that. Go, king, go! <laughs> okay. Lesson, my lord. Turn base, definitely. Press X to select your power. The new kid. All right, let's. Uh, we can control Butters and Kyle as well. Press A to use your brow. Sure. Ooh. It's just hitting for now. Powers with knockback can cause extra damage to enemies by knocking them into other enemies, allies, or objects. I got a bad feeling if I'm not afraid of you and your strategic king combos. Ha! <laughs> Our king is undefeatable. Okay, really hit him this time, King. Sure, we will. Ow! We can't stop him. Ready the guards of the Dark Court. Wow, did you see that? The King's amazing. His powers are unparalleled. Oh, well, thank you. This way, King. You can't take us all on. Yeah, just walk away. Yes. Don't listen to him, King. Punch their lights out. I will. Can we Come pick on, up the swords? No. Attacking an enemy first grants combat advantage, giving you the first turn. Yeah. To see the full combat turn order, check the timeline on the lower right. Those are just all enemies. So Butters and uh, Kyle are not in my party. Different powers can affect different areas of the combat grid. You can preview a power's range by checking the diagram under its icon. So we have a different power now. Hey, what? I'm supposed to go first. Nah, -uh, the king got combat advantage. He goes first. So if we move right here. So what does this do? Why? Fart. Oh, okay. We can. Can we fart from here? Or just from here, maybe. Uh, okay, you went first. We get it. Just go. Wah! You show him, King. Oh, the humanity. It's fine. They're the bad guys. Oh, yeah. Go, King. Oh, man. You have no chance against all of us. Okay, let's try the farting again. Okay, we can't do that. I guess we could have just farted from here. Let's, let's take on this guy if we can. Oh, they're moving. All right, let's take on this one then. Good. Oh, Jesus Christ! The Moors will triumph. Ah, oh, man, he's still not dead. Okay, it's my turn again. Let's fart from here if we can. We can hit them both. Yes, that's what we want to do. Eight Our damage. King off your puny blows. All right, I'm still holding up pretty strong enough. Blah. Mm, halfway down. I don't think I have the power to uh, regenerate quite yet. That's going to be funny. All right. Hurry, my lord. They need our help. Stand aside or die. 
We're going through that door. You can't. Oh, yeah? Why not? Because everything in front of here is lava. Oh, dude, no way. All that is lava? Yep, everything from here to here is lava. You can't cross it. Shit! Come on, let's get inside. We can't. They're seeing everything in front of the door is lava. Oh, that's not fair. What do we do, my king? What do you do now? You die. Release the dragon. <laughs> A dragon? We're fucked. That's the dragon roaring. Enemies may attempt to attack you while you explore. Why isn't Crack fighting with us or something? Okay. If an enemy ambushes you, they'll automatically get the first combat turn. Okay, my health has been regenerated. The new kid, that's what we are. Let's see what we can do from here. We can fart away at him. Or we can't. Okay, this is a good spot. We can hit two actually. Or wow, three. Did he just fart on a dragon? Heck yeah, he did. Ready to fire breath. Striped breath squares indicate the damage zone of an impending attack. Move to a safe square to avoid getting hit. Get out of the way of the fire breath. Don't okay, end we'll your do. turn where it's gonna hit you. To end your turn, okay, yeah, sure. Press and hold, sure. Let's let's do it here. Ha! Our king dodged it! Ah oh, damn it! Okay, if you get a fire breath attack, our king gets his hammer of heavenly rain. Okay, then we'll use it. Let's see if we can uh, reach that from here. You can't stop the kit! Car! Car. That's hilarious. Stay out of the street, damn kids! Clear! As I was saying, you can't stop the king! He is all powerful! Okay, I was about to use this uh, power. Let's move up a space. Hammer of Heavenly Rain. Grant a subject a thorough sm smiting. What a smiting! Whoa, shit! Dragon Slayer! King Douchebag. Oh my god, he defeated the dragon! No freaking way! That kid's amazing! Wow, they really seem to uh, like me. Let's talk to the boys here. Maybe they're the way in through the garage, my lord. It's just if a the way in through the garage, the king will find it. Yes, only the king can find these secret way in through the garage. If I mean, if there is one. Yes, only the king with his infinite wisdom and strength can get past this impassable barrier. Alright, let's just move back. Okay, so the door is locked. Go ahead, your highness. Use your unparalleled intellect to figure out a way in. Can we uh, go in here? Oh, we're going to punch crack king. objects. Wow, did you see that? The king's amazing. We can move objects. Press and hold to move. I'm trying. Let's see if we can move this. Or this. I guess we'll put it here. Well, okay. King Doofbag is searching skillful, warrior. Did you see how he moved that ladder and used it to climb up? He okay, truly I... is the most powerful king in all the realms. Thank you. All right, oh, so we need to climb up. Amazing. Let's see what else we got here. Where are you going, my lord? That is world's end. Yes, I'm going. Let's go up here. It's a little bit of a Game of Thrones, Game of Thrones sound. I thought the king was going to do a sweet jump, but then he just did that. Oh my! You're dead. <laughs> okay, yeah, sure. Let's, let's return to the last checkpoint. I guess we uh, needed to jump in time. Speak, bard. What happened to the stick of truth? The wizard had it thrown into the ocean. Lies. You shall feel the wrath of the Moorish. Unhand him, you heathens! Release the bard, or you'll have the king to deal with. The king. They say he can slay a dragon with one blow. That's right. And if you don't... Uh, wait. Wait. Whoa. Where is the wizard? Uh, I thought he was with you guys. No, we got a distress signal to come help him here. Psst. 
The wizard is gone. My name is the Coon. I'm from the future. Dude, we said we're not playing that anymore. Yeah, we're all split up. What's the point? This is the point. In my time, there is a massive crime wave and missing cats. I knew my only hope was to assemble the team. Hey, you can't switch games like this. Where's the stick of truth? Shut up, Kevin. This isn't about some dumb stick. There's a cat in trouble, and it's the key to finding the crime syndicate new to our town. In the future. Crime syndicate? That that sounds too heavy for Coon and friends. Well, what do you want, Clyde? You want the fucking Freedom Pals to find the missing cat? Get the $100 reward and make their superhero franchise more popular? Fuck the Freedom Pals, dude. That's right. Oopsikins! There's a loud ringing coming from your basement playroom. The Coon Alert. Come on, Coon friends. Go get your stuff and report back to the Coon Lair. In the future, Coon and friends assemble. Sorry, guys, you can't play with us. We're playing superheroes now, and you guys are dorks. And that's that. We're not playing the Stick of Truth anymore. Um, we're going to play the Coon and Friends, but that's going to be next time. I hope we can join. We probably can. I'm going to keep these episodes about 30 minutes long. So, uh, yeah, stay tuned. I hope you liked it. I hope you liked the game. And till the next one.